Hello! Today I'm going to show you how to draw a holly. Let's open a new document, change the stroke color to none and the fill color to light green. Press the letter P for the pen tool and we will draw a leaf. Click somewhere in the middle, then move up and left. Click, hold and drag to make a curve. Now press and hold the ALT key on your keyboard to switch to the Convert Anchor Point tool. Next, still holding the ALT key, click on the anchor point to make a corner. And release the ALT key. This will automatically switch to the pen tool again. These few shortcuts will speed up your work. Let's make another curve. Click, hold and drag to make a curve. Holding the ALT key, click on the anchor point to make a corner. And keep making those curves to form a leaf. And let's close the shape by clicking on the beginning anchor point. Now press the letter A to switch to the Direct Selection tool and let's adjust the corners. Let's zoom in. Now we will add a white streak. Select the Pen tool, change the fill color to white and create a long and narrow streak. Now we'll add a dark green shadow that will follow the contour of our leaf. Select the dark green color Start at the top and follow the outside path. Then move up next to the white streak and finish at the top. Let's adjust the curves. Press Ctrl 0 to see the whole page. Select all and let's make it a little smaller. Zoom in on the bottom part. Next we will draw a red berry. Press the letter L for the ellipse tool. Change the fill color to dark red and holding the Shift and Alt keys on your keyboard, draw a small circle. Let's zoom in. Now we will add a gradient to it. Open the gradient panel, click on the red color hold and drag it to the gradient slider. Now click on the white color box and holding the Alt key on your keyboard, choose a light red color. Let's change the type to radio and close the panel. Press the letter G for the gradient tool and apply the gradient. Now we will add a few details. Select the ellipse tool, change the fill color to black and draw a small circle. Now we will add a white streak to the side. Change the fill color to white and draw a small and narrow ellipse. Switch to the Direct Selection tool, click on the bottom anchor point and move it down. Do the same with the top anchor point. Now press the letter V to select the shape, rotate it and move it to the side.
Now drag a box to select everything, go to Object and choose Group. Let's zoom out. Next we are going to make two additional berries and two more leaves. Zoom in. Select the berry and holding the Alt key on your keyboard move it to the side to make a copy. And repeat. Let's make this one a little bigger. Bring them closer together. And make the bottom one a little smaller. And move it up. Now we are going to copy the leaf. Select the leaf. Go to Object and choose Group. Now click on the leaf and holding the Alt key on your keyboard move it to the side to make a copy. And let's make one more copy. Now rotate it, place it between the two berries and make it a little narrower. And let's do the same with the other leaf. Now let's zoom in and adjust the position, curves and corners until you like it. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.